Yeah, I thought it was a great weekend for us. Um, it got production from all four lines. Our D were very involved, and uh, those are two good teams that that uh, I thought we we played really well against. And and um, you know, the, obviously that's nice to see. Um, and you know, now we're moving on to to UConn next week. Delaney, in that second period, uh, Maury Murphy came down, scores 25 seconds into the frame. You come right back down and, and give the Eagles the lead. What are you, what are your thoughts in that period, and kind of the opening of the floodgates that happened after that? Um, I think we've really just been working on like going full speed all the time, regardless of what's happening in the game. And just our confidence and kind of our line is getting everyone going and keeping everyone going. So I think we really had to shine at some point during the weekend. So we really put our heads together and zapped a couple there. So. Can you take us through that second goal? It looked like, especially on the replay, there's three Providence defenders around you, and you somehow end up going through all three of them, down ice and scoring on that breakaway. Can you just take us on what you saw um, to get it past uh, the goalie? Uh, I mean, I had a couple of bounces go my way there, and I kept pushing and pushing, so I was lucky there. And then head up the last second, she gave me what she gave me, so tapped one in. Can you just talk a little bit more about your line mates? Uh, we talked to Coach yesterday about how every line seemed to contribute this weekend, and today it seemed like your line was really the one shining defensively and offensively. Just talk about your line mates a little bit. Um, I don't know. We stick to having fun out there. We're always together, too. So, I mean, we – We've been playing together for a while now. We know what we need to do, and sometimes we get it done, and sometimes we want more, and we always want more. So, I mean, we took care of it today for the most part. We just got to keep it going. Anything else for Delaney? Good job. Thanks. Zapped. Have fun. <laughs> Coach, all around effort again tonight. You get a shorthanded goal, you get a power play goal, you keep them scoreless on the penalty. It just seemed like you guys are having fun out there. Yeah, you know, <coughs> excuse me. Um, I really like this team. You know, they, they, you know, really buy into what we're saying. They're they're playing Boston College hockey, uh, and they're continuing to try to get better every practice, every game. Um, you know, one of the things that we uh, told them before that second period was to that we need to. Um, you know, put in some of our our opportunities because we can't leave it up to penalties or anything that might uh, mix up the you know mix up the flow of the game and and uh, and I really thought they did a great job of putting it you know putting it away in that in that second period by putting a couple in and putting them back on their heels. How do these games help you, especially in the stretch that you have coming up right now? BU's at nine, Northeastern's top five, and you have Wisconsin and Minnesota towards the end of the month. How important do these games become as you get into kind of the latter half of the season? Yeah, they're all important. Um, you know, I think that's one thing. Um, you know, our league, uh, you know, this team just beat Northeastern last weekend. Uh, then UNH goes and beats them. Then, you know, it's it's uh, kind of all over the all over the place right now. And I think um, I think you got to be ready for every game that you're playing, you know. And, and for us, the next one up is UConn, and, and they're a tough defensive team. We know that. We've always known that. Um, and you know they're gonna, you know we're gonna have to be prepared for them. Um, but this, you know, our season all along, we have we have a great competition that we're playing against, and and I think our team is really excited to play. Uh, Coach, how impressed are you? I know you gave a uh, power play goal at the end of the period, but how impressed are you overall to Kelly Kill, especially giving up three power play goals last weekend? Yeah, I thought it was much better, much better effort. Um, I think that uh, they, you know. We we focused a little bit on on uh, blocking some shots and 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 uh, kind of tightening up that the, our penalty kill and and I thought, um, you know that that stung a little bit last weekend when we gave that up and 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 I think it stung for the kids you know the players who are out there and and everyone and I knew you know I know that they know it's important that you have to put your body on the line and make some uh, blocks for for your goaltenders and and uh, really try to. Um, you know, penalty kill. You're down a guy, so you gotta you gotta fight as mu with with everything you have. And I I think uh, it was much better uh, today, especially you know Providence power play. They move a lot. They're pretty quick. They have that Maury Murphy finds a way to score goals. And uh, you know, so you got to be aware all the time with how they're moving. And um, you know, I thought we really read it well. And anything else? Well, the non-2 o'clock Fridays.